All right, guys, in today's short, when you're trying to find parts and you come across a regular production option code, these three character symbols that you need to identify, where do you find them? Well, in the mid 80s to up to 2018, you'd find a sticker. And I'll show you all the places the sticker could be found that you'll see these codes listed on it. But starting in 2018, GM went to a QR code. Now, not all the models got it, but I'll show you the ones that did, some examples, and it would be on the driver's side, either door or door jab. So let's take a look at the different locations where you can find this information. All right, guys, here we are in a 2019 Chevrolet Impala, and here's an example of this QR code that we were talking about earlier. So this one has this. Now what we're going to do is we're going to come up here with another phone, and we're going to scan this code with the camera app, in the case of this iPhone. It's going to go over to the browser, and then we'll turn it sideways so you can see it here. And you can see here, if we zoom in a little bit, right, there's the format that I went over earlier. There's the VIN, right, then you got the other information that we showed, and then here's all of the RPO codes, and then uh, as well as the paint code. So now let me show you some vehicles that don't have this yet, as well as some older ones. On this 2020 Chevrolet Spark, it's in the glove box right there on the left-hand side. On this 2018 Cruze, it's sitting right in front of the spare tire in the trunk area. In this 2016 Chevrolet Sonic, it's in the wheel well area where the spare tire sits. On this 2012 Chevrolet Tahoe, it's right inside the glove box on the left-hand side. On this 2006 Cobalt, if you lift the lid of the trunk, you'll find it right here on the driver's side in the rear area. On this 2000 Suburban, it's also right inside the glove box. This 82 Chevrolet Camaro, it's sitting inside the rear locked compartment on the driver's side. On this 1997 Cavalier, when you lift up the cover, that covers the spare tire, you'll find this guy right underneath. All right, so here's an example in a 1988 Chevrolet S10 pickup located right inside the glove box. On this 1988 C1500, it's right here in the glove box. On this 86 Buick Park Avenue, it's located right on the bottom of the trunk. You can see it right there. All right, guys, I hope this video helped you out in finding your RPO codes to order your parts. If it did, appreciate you paying it for by hitting that like button. And as always, thanks for watching.